Hello, beautiful people. Welcome to Remy's Fashion. My name is Remy Ford Hyde. On this channel, we upload pattern drafting and sewing tutorials every week. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you a step-by-step -step illustration on how to draft a tube top pattern, which is also known as strapless or bustier top. This is not a pattern drafting tutorial, but an illustration on steps to draft a strapless or tube top pattern. So let's get started. To draft this pattern, you will need your bust circumference measurement, your waist circumference measurement, over bust circumference measurement, under bust circumference measurement, your nipple to nipple measurement, which is also known as the bust span measurement, the length of your top. We're going to use our basic bodies to draft the tube top or strapless top. If you want to learn how to draft one, we have a step by step illustration on how to draft a basic bodies. I'll put the link in the description box below. Once we have our basic bodies, we will now measure and mark out our nipple to nipple measurement, which is also known as bust span. Taking your measurement from the center front on the bust line, under the bust line, and on the waistline, just as indicated in the diagram. And then we will draw a straight line to connect the points. The next thing you will do is to measure one inch on both sides of the nipple to nipple line on the waist and under bust lines and then you connect them together with a vertical line as indicated in the diagram then measure half an inch from the bust line downwards and mark you will then connect from the half an inch that you went down on the bust line to under the bust using a curve ruler so as to avoid pointed edges just as shown in the diagram the next thing is to extend the bust span line from the bust line to the chest line. You can use one inch or two inches above the chest line, depending on how high you want your top to be. And then we'll measure one inch on both sides of our bust span measurement on the chest line. Then connect to the new bust line, just as indicated in the diagram. The next thing we're going to do is to draft out your desired neckline. Add back your dart allowance to your basic bodies before cutting out. You can either add your sewing allowances on your pattern or on your fabric. Cut out your pattern pieces and add notches. This is what your strapless bustier front tube top looks like, just as shown in the diagram. And then the next thing we're going to do now is to draft the back pattern. For the back pattern, we'll start with the basic back pattern with a dart just as in the diagram. You can either decide how deep you want your back to be, then measure and mark, and then connect with a curve or straight line to meet the armhole. Or you divide the back pattern into two along the dark lines. Draw a horizontal line across, just as indicated in the diagram. Then cut out the top of the back. This is what the back looks like after cutting out. This is before cutting out the dark lines. The next thing is to cut out the dart, just as indicated in the diagram. This is what the back tube top looks like after cutting out the dart. So these are the pattern pieces, both for the front and the back. Hope this illustration was helpful. Thank you for watching. See you in another tutorial. Take care and God bless.